Happy Easter Sunday everyone. Uh, today is the 9th of April. It's a Sunday. It's church day. Don't ask me why am I not at church. You will see that on my next video. So actually I made a video on um, the day that Jesus was crucified. That was Good Friday. So I haven't had the time to um, edit it. I only completed it yesterday and I'm only going to upload it tomorrow on the Monday. So today I said, you know, I can't upload that video today. I have to make a video for today so that I can um, put that one out tomorrow. So yeah, you'll see that video tomorrow. So stay tuned for that. I hope that I will upload it tomorrow. I I'm sure I'm going to upload it tomorrow because I was supposed to upload it yesterday already, but I was so sick and tired that I couldn't do it. But anyways, enough about that, guys. If it's your very first time on my channel and coming across this video, give this video a like, give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel. I mean, like, what are you waiting for? Anyways. I wanted to talk about how you can overcome the fear of the camera, the fear of starting a YouTube channel. I know there's so many people. I love to read comments. So I always read comments about people. Yes, I want to start, you know, but I'm just so scared. I don't know when I can start, you know, uploading my video. I don't know. You know what? You will never know unless you try. Just pick up the phone record you know you can use your phone you can use anything that is recording and you can upload the video any kind of phone let me tell you something i once had a samsung i think it was a s3 or s4 when i lost my other phone i made a video and i think the quality was good so yeah anyways this is naomi hill tv and i'm naomi hill of course oops I am Naomi Hill, of course, and um, yeah, I started my YouTube channel in 2020, end of 2020, all because my children love to watch YouTube videos. And when I saw that um, you can actually earn an income or make a living with YouTube, we've got a lot of South African full-time YouTubers and they're making a good amount of um, income. They're making a good salary just to sustain them. But I also want to tell you, don't be fooled by all the luxuries that you see. Don't be fooled. Don't be fooled because I think a lot of people get intimidated by all the fancy things they see and all the luxuries. And they feel like, oh my goodness, I won't have all of this. I, I won't have money to buy stuff to do hauls. And you don't have to feel pressure to do all that stuff You because they also started somewhere. So you have to start somewhere. Don't go out of your way and buy expensive stuff buy she in walls and all that stuff and oh, oh gosh you will go broke trying to look rich don't make that mistake so as i was saying how do you actually get over the fear of um being in front of the camera making videos making content i always say if you are starting and you don't know what to do lucky for those that know already that have a niche and they know what to do but if you are starting and you really don't know, unlike us that is still <laughs> trying to get a niche, start with the intro first, introduce yourself. And that way people will know who are they um, dealing with. And don't overpromise people that um, I'm going to show you um, walls. I will be doing cooking. I will be doing this. And do don't overpromise your audience because that is what they will be expecting. They will be expecting a lot from you. And it's going to cause a lot of pressure. And a lot of people have burned out the first time they start making their videos. Even on the first video, you get terrible burnout. I remember when I sit and, and did my, I hope I still, I can maybe record that video or do a screenshot. When I did that first video, on oh my word, I was sweating. I was sweating. I was so stressed out. My heart was beating fast. I was like thinking to myself, <laughs> because I was planning this video the whole day and I don't know how many takes I did in order to get the video that I actually wanted to upload and you find that it's not even the one that you wanted to upload. You were just so desperate and you ended up the uploading that video. But nonetheless, when you start out, it is okay to stress. It is okay to feel 
you know panicky and um, to have all of that that is why it is good to plan in advance when you start your video but make it a short video when you start um, to upload or do your first recording of a video so um, you are going to be nervous you're gonna be a nerve wreck and you're gonna expect you're gonna expect a huge turnout you're gonna expect thousands of views that is for all of us it's just normal because you look at other people's videos and you see, oh my goodness, they're already going viral. The videos is blowing up with the first or second video. A lot of people actually, when they start the YouTube channels, they are either popular on TikTok or Instagram or any other social media app. And you want to compare yourself now to those people. Don't do that because why? You will feel a lot of pressure and a lot of burnout trying to be somebody that you're not don't i think that is the most important thing if i would advise somebody that would start a youtube channel or that is so scared or you have this fear don't compare yourself or your journey to that of someone else or another influencer you have to start somewhere and make sure that you have an instagram account whereby you can also upload pictures and you also need to put your instagram handle on i know i don't do that often but yeah if i would have told myself or known this when i started my channel i would have done that but now make sure that people is aware of your other social media handles your tiktok account your instagram if you have a facebook account specifically for your youtube channel do that tell people people can also go onto your instagram inbox you um what what uh, advice or to chat to you and all that stuff and uh, there is the uh, um, something that can also boost your channel that is something that can attract more people to watch you um instagram uh you know what don't go and post things on instagram because i know i'm sorry to say this but a lot of influencers they get views if they show if you have naked if you show skin you get views and people don't do that to yourself do not lower your standards just to fit into the norm be yourself be authentic and i'm telling you the right amount of people will actually follow you so anyways guys i was talking about getting over the fear of starting your youtube channel but as i was as i was saying that guys just be yourself start recording press that record button this is what i'm doing i'm sitting here in my lounge right now and i've just pressed the record button i'm honestly i'm a bit nervous i'm not gonna lie for anybody i've been driving for how many years six years i'm still nervous when i'm driving and people will tell you so even the other influencers that has is famous that is popular they will tell you that they still do get nervous they still do get that um, anxiety uh, and it's it's normal but just always know how to f come back when you have that burnout or get that anxiety but i don't want to talk much i'm i'll make another video i'll make another video um if you want me to make another video about starting off first um how to do your first video what you need to do and i mean i am happy to do my research and tell you that this is what you know i'm not an expert i am definitely not an expert as you can see me i'm just a mama with three kids working full time as an insurance consultant and i'm trying my my thing on this youtube world and i know um probably i might just i might just do this full time who knows i might just <laughs> I might just want to do this going forward, but I've seen a lot of times, I've seen a lot of comments about how people are scared of starting a YouTube channel. It's just something that keeps, you know what, the biggest fear is that you are expecting too much and you want to be perfect. Nobody's perfect. Even the people that is watching you, those mean and negative comments is going to build you and going to make you strong. And let me tell you what you do with, with mean comments or negative comments. You can delete them you can delete them you don't have to sit and entertain negative comments or watch that because i know it can depress you if something something mean about you ask our influencers they'll tell you it can be very depressing and it can cause huge anxiety to you and you end up just stopping making content and or it can turn you into something that you're not don't do that remove the negative and the toxic comments post your videos make videos 
record your videos make at least five videos five videos for the month and see how things go and like i said the number one thing is please don't go broke trying to look rich because why you want to fit into a norm of vloggers that already have everything don't do that to yourself i once made a video there was cockroaches and flies all over on my vlogs let me tell you that's reality and there is some things people don't want to see and there is some things people will understand when they see that and i'm telling you sometimes i make videos where my kids is making noise or i'm just myself i'm just myself but let me tell you something vlogging ain't working for me i'm, I'm just gonna be honest there's some things that just don't work for you um so it's always best you're gonna make hundreds of videos and you're gonna try different niches and you will eventually get to the, the niche that you need to get to um but like i said if you already have a niche kudos to you you have your videos planned out right for you you you'll never go out of content let me tell you that so yes guys um like this video like this video so i can make more of the sit down videos and i can tell you um my burnout i can tell you um whatever you want to know about starting if you want to become a youtube youtuber a content creator in south africa it's very easy um to make content you know um especially if you're working full-time if you already have you need the money to make the money you know um like i said in other videos in in south africa the number one um videos that actually get views people love vlogs here people love entertainment channels about celebrities people love food going out eating um luxury stuff and all that stuff you know so but it's not for everybody not everybody has all that but start with what you have you can just sit down and talk about uh, do story times talk about yourself about your life about your work what you do you know show people the type of food that you make every night you know um get ready with me sit and put your makeup on get ready talk about story time my ex did my ex did this and what 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 but then don't don't try to fabricate things don't try to lie on your channel because people have a way of finding things out and it has a way of coming out, you know. But I always say, don't always believe in the things that you see on social media. People have, they put this perception that their life is perfect and it's good. I've, I've watched videos where content creators doesn't wear makeup and the day that they don't wear makeup, like, oh, I'm so sorry, I look so, um, I look like this and, you know, they feel even bad because they always have this perception of looking pretty for no you need to be yourself you need to always be yourself don't always want to paint your face and um for people people will only love that what they see that face and that person wearing all these fancy clothes and always going out and all that stuff that is why people love what they see and they you will never see huge amount of people will turn up for you when you start your own business on the sideline because they only enjoy that part of your life so you see how tricky social media can be but anyways guys 13 minutes i am out and out can i do a, a thumbnail <laughs> Please subscribe to this channel, like this video, share it out, you know, do all those things, you know, do all those things. I'm going to put my Instagram down here. Um, obviously, in the video, I talk about my Instagram account. I'm going to put my Instagram account there so that you can chat to me. You can come follow me. But yeah, I've got another video that's coming up tomorrow. And be sure to check that out. Subscribe to my channel. Subscribe. <laughs> Ooh, guys, you uh, this is not a crazy person like this. Oh gosh. But anyway, see you. <laughs>